All right, here we go, 613 everybody on this Saturday morning and uh, it's going to be another nice day around West Michigan. We've got sunshine to go from start all the way to finish. Not going to be quite as warm today. We got to 85 yesterday. I think more like the upper 70s uh, here this afternoon. It is actually fairly humid as you take your first step outdoors, but uh, that humidity is going to be coming down late morning and this afternoon. And you know what I'm talking about uh, when you're out and about here this afternoon, a drier feel certainly than we've had the last several days. 63 on the thermometer in GR. It is not far from that along the lakeshore nor down to the south. A little bit cooler though here, as you might expect. Fremont and Big Rapids to open it up. Uh, just a couple degrees shy of the 60 degree marker and the dew points look very similar to those actual temperatures and therefore we've got some high relative humidity values at the surface and that's when you can get a little bit of cloud cover to form perhaps some fog and I wouldn't really say fog but some areas of thicker haze around to begin and winds are very light out of a general westerly direction those will take on more of a northwest or north northwest direction as we go forth 10 to 15 even 20 miles per hour. So though they are very light right now, they will pick up to a level where you're notice a few breezes here into the afternoon. 76 at noon and 78 at 5 p.m. That's where we top out at today. We'll do the bulk of our warming here through the first several hours and just kind of slowly work upward as we get into the mid afternoon period. That's because some cooler air is trying to work in from Canada, kind of offsetting any tremendous upward movement on the thermometer to this afternoon. But still 78, that's about perfect, I would say, for a temperature. And we'll be there again tomorrow before we start to crank up some heat here Monday and Tuesday. And, you know, I don't think we're going to be that far from 90 degrees already on Monday. We won't make it to 90, I don't believe, but uh, upper 80s on Monday and right around 90 to the lower 90s on Tuesday. Won't last forever, though, because this tropical storm down in the Gulf of Mexico, this is Tropical Storm Cristobal. Uh, it was a tropical storm a few days ago, then went into Mexico, weakened, became a tropical depression, now has re-emerged into the Gulf of Mexico and has strengthened a little bit. The system, though, these uh, tropical systems, when they go over land for any great amount of time and go over mountainous terrain uh, like it has in Mexico, it kind of disrupts the circulation and makes it uh, kind of tough to really gather itself here a lot once it gets back out over open water. Plus, there is a fair amount of wind shear on uh, portions of the uh, side of this system. So it's inhibiting any tremendous development as it comes toward the Louisiana coast, thank goodness. But it will be about a 60 mile per hour sustained system and then move to the north and then eventually head off to the northeast in Canada. Uh, that low pressure track does not come right at West Michigan. But I'll tell you, as these tropical storms do tend to lose their tropical characteristics, they do maintain a lot of wind on the right hand side and that's where we'll be for late Tuesday and Wednesday. So a real windy period. Stay tuned to the upcoming forecast and uh, the um, the upcoming days to see how this plays out. We will have some showers. I don't think certainly not a tremendous amount of rain with this system, but we will have some. But I think the wind will be the bigger player into the midweek period. You don't see much going on in the model here today. This little band of clouds here over Minnesota and Wisconsin that will try to come in here overnight tonight into tomorrow morning. It's not going to be thick, but it will probably filter or dim some sun to some degree on Sunday. It'll still be bright with high temperatures in the upper 70s. And then there's that big jump on Monday. I don't even think a cloud in the sky. We're going to maximize all our warming on Monday, start to build in afternoon clouds on Tuesday, but make it a 92. And then once the system comes through, Sarah, it does turn a bit cooler there later in the week. Anthony, thank